For the past year and a half, Suffolk Babies has provided free antenatal education to over 1,500 pregnant women and their birth partner in Suffolk. We fund this entirely through our range of courses, from pregnancy through to preschool. We don't receive any funding from the NHS to do this. But this is really only half of what we do. Our real job is selling a bigger theory, one that defies austerity and budget cuts, doesn't rely on short-term funding or charitable donations. We want to challenge the concept of charity in the 21st century. We want a new form of capitalism. Our model frees us from the way that companies profit from women when they're at their most vulnerable. It also frees us from reliance on funding at a time when this just isn't available and services continue to be cut from those who need it most. Why should businesses be profiting off the vulnerable? Why can't capitalism be a force for good? When people have a baby, a large proportion of them will happily pay to go to classes. And this is the perfect opportunity to do something new and different and drive social change through putting community interest first above individual gain. It's not about making a donation to charity either, it's about the client getting something they want and giving back to the local community at the same time. This is a sustainable future and one that will last long after our time. When someone buys a course from us they are affecting change in four powerful ways. Firstly, they are supporting a mother in achieving flexible employment and also being able to look after her family at the same time. They're receiving a high quality course that will help them understand their child better, improving their bond and well-being. They're joining a community of parents for friendship, support and camaraderie at a time that can be lonely and isolating. And finally, any profits from their course are going directly into providing free antenatal education, which is of a more consistent quality, more comprehensive than that previously offered by the NHS. Not everyone has been able to see the bigger picture and understand what we're trying to achieve. They either think we're just some girls who are singing nursery rhymes for a bit of pin money, or they think we must be these hard-nosed businesswomen who must have some ulterior motive. It has been really hard to get people, especially midwives, to understand the concept of community interest. Happily, we have had big successes over the last couple of years, including developing a unique relationship with the NHS Trust in Ipswich. We've outgrown our current centre and we're now working with other agencies to extend the support we're able to offer to young parents and parents who struggle with literacy. We have also had amazing feedback from parents and many stay with us from their first pregnancy through to when their last child starts school. People trust us and enjoy coming to classes with us. When we started working with new mums, long before setting up Suffolk Babies, we saw that women were woefully underprepared for birth and life with a new baby. Their mental and physical health was suffering and we dreamt that one day we could make a real change. Well, it's not just a nice dream. It's our reality and we're making it happen. <laughs>